got to be good at, at the business aspect of the business as well as at the performing aspect of the business. I probably would have written more early on and tried to get a job writing for a TV show while I was young and, you know, that counts for something. Last comic standing, uh, 19, uh, 2000 and I guess it was five, uh, Vegas Finals. Um, when the when uh, Drew Carey and my father gave me a standing ovation, and then that was preceded by not advancing to the next round, so preceded by the biggest disappointment. You can see this on YouTube if it's still up at the Open Anthony An Animation Festival. I was I don't know if I was booed off the stage. I didn't leave the stage, so technically I wasn't booed off the stage. Although any normal person would have left the stage, but I wanted to make my money, so I didn't want to leave the stage early. And I proceeded to recite Shakespeare in lieu of doing my act, because it didn't really matter at that point anyway. I don't know whether they would have paid me if I had left or not, but uh, I didn't want to take that chance. The one thing that they can, you know, the, the one way you cannot get paid in comedy is either to say a word you, you were told not to say, like a curse word, or not do your time. Obviously, the open and open Anthony show, I could say any, anything I wanted, but I wanted to make sure I did my time. They probably would have paid me anyway, but I didn't want to take that chance. It's something I haven't seen before is, is obviously counts for a lot in terms of what's funny. Uh, Tracy Morgan to me is very funny because um, I've just never seen the likes of the guy. You know, if you've seen him on, on stage, he's... Uh, well, he's insane, but he's insane, you know, wherever he goes. I'm Dan Adam, and you're watching Five Questions.